I'd like to continue now and show you the muscles of the forearm that have actions at the wrist, hand, and fingers. And this time I'm going to cover the muscles of the posterior compartment. I'm going to start with the side from the fifth digit, the pinky finger. And this muscle right here, this is the extensor carpi ulnaris. It has its origin on the lateral epicondyle of the humerus and it inserts on the fifth metacarpal. Its action is to extend and adduct the wrist. The next muscle I want to show you, this very tiny one, it is the extensor digiti minimi and it is responsible for extending the fifth digit. Pinky up. The next muscle I'd like to show you is the extensor digitorum. You can see that the extensor digitorum also comes from the lateral epicondyle of the humerus and it inserts on the uh, posterior surfaces of the phalanges of digits 2 through 5 and you can actually see the tendons of the extensor digitorum reaching to digits 2, 4, sorry, 2, 3, 4, and 5. The next muscle that I want to show you is the extensor carpi radialis. There is a longus and a brevis. The extensor carpi radialis has its origin on the supracondylar ridge and lateral epicondyle of the humerus. It inserts at the base of the second and third metacarpal. It extends and abducts the wrist.